Hello and welcome to the next chapter in our ongoing series of tutorials that will help familiarize you and improve your skills in Corel Paint Shop Pro Photo X2 Ultimate. My name is Robert Corel. In today's short lesson I'm going to show you how to load raw photographs into Paint Shop Pro. I've got the organizer open with a couple of photographs from three different cameras. The first of which is taken from a Nikon D200 and in all cases I saved a JPEG and the raw photograph directly in the camera. Second one is from Sony Alpha 300. The D200 above is a fairly advanced uh, professional level DSLR. The next is more of an entry level DSLR and then the bottom is a Canon G10 which is an advanced compact digital camera. So three different manufacturers, three different raw file formats. In each case, the JPEG is a standard JPEG photograph. The camera takes the raw data from the sensor and applies presets and settings to it to come up with the final JPEG. When you open a JPEG, nothing special happens. You can double click on it and just open it. By default, when you open a raw file, Smart Photo Fix will open. there. You can see the preview windows just like normal. The fact that it's a raw photograph doesn't change how this dialog works. You can turn off the advanced options. You can ask it to suggest the settings for you. And here you've got the latitude because you're dealing with raw of working with data that's not apparently visible in the JPEG fairly non-destructively. You can push the image so far one way or another for example, by turning the whites really white, you can blow those out. But essentially, if you're dealing, you're dealing with more data than a JPEG can hold. So using Smart Photo Fix, when you open up the file, allows you to perform a first round of editing to the photograph. And essentially, what you're doing is creating the the, the photo that you're going to continue editing. Now you can turn that behavior off from File Preferences, File Format Preferences general tab uncheck open camera raw images with smart photo fix the next raw photo I open will just open in the interface and then it will be up to me to decide what adjustments or settings I want to change to edit this photo adjust brightness contrast histogram adjustment and so forth now here's where you run into some differences between working with JPEG versus RAW. Some of the settings in the adjust menu and so forth must um, require that the image be converted to 8 bits per channel RGB color. So click OK to make that dialog box go away and then make your other adjustments. So RAW photographs generally require an additional layer, a layer of processing when you open them up and sometimes, depending on what you're after, conversion to that lower bit depth. Last one here is from the G10 and this one looks like it's got a very strong yellow color cast to the raw file. Now you'll you'll find that this happens occasionally. Essentially there are a million and one cameras out there each with their own proprietary raw file formats some may or may not uh, which be you know intelligible to to most people uh, this is why Corel updates PaintShop Pro with patches and updates and so forth to try to catch those and fix them and this is an example of one that's just not quite right so um, basically in that case you want to work with the JPEG and that opens up just fine Okay, that's it for this lesson. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.